Hello everyone. Let's provide the solution to this problem. Solution. We have x squared minus 1 equal to 2 into bracket x plus 1. And um, this problem will not even require us to open this bracket. Okay, what we'll do is to apply difference of two squares here because this is the same thing as x squared minus 1 squared, right? So this will be equal to 2 into x plus 1. Now, the next thing I will do is to apply difference of two squares here so that I will be having x plus 1 into x minus 1 that is for the left hand side now on the right we have 2 into x plus 1 now here is what i want to do i want to bring this to the left so i'll be having x plus 1 into x minus 1 then we have minus because if this comes it becomes negative 2 into x plus 1 and this is equal to 0 okay so from here what will i do i have to factor out x plus 1 so that if i do that i'll be having x plus 1 as the common factor then here i have x minus 1 then here i have minus 2 so I can combine this because this has already gone out. So this is equal to 0. And then from here we have x plus 1, one of the factors. Then x minus 3, the second factor. And then equal to 0. From here we apply 0 product rule. Meaning that x plus 1 is equal to 0 or x minus 3 is equal to 0. From here, x is equal to 0 minus 1 or x is equal to 0 plus 3. This means that our x is equal to minus 1 or x is equal to 3. Now, to bring the two solutions together, we have x to be equal to minus, okay, minus 1 minus 1 or plus 3 so these are the two values of x and i would like us to check for the two values of x we have x squared minus 1 equal to 2 into x plus 1 now if i use minus 1 as the value of x then I'm, i'll be having minus 1 squared right but then you will be making a mistake if you do not put this in brackets. Then we have minus 1. Will this be equal to 2 into minus 1 plus 1? Because x is, um, x is actually minus 1. Now from here, minus 1 squared is 1. Then we have minus 1. And it is definitely equal to 2 multiplied by 0. Because minus 1 plus 1 is 0. Now, 1 minus 1 is 0 and it's equal to 2 times 0, which is 0. So, this value of x, which is x to be equal to minus 1, satisfies the equation. Now, let us try the second value of x, which is um, plus 3. So, here, in place of x squared, I will be writing 3 squared minus 1. Will this be equal to 2 into um, 3? Okay. Because um, x in the bracket is 3, then we have plus 1. Do you think the left hand side and the right hand side are equal? This is 9 minus 1. Will this be equal to 2 into bracket? 3 plus 1 is 4. I think by now, you should be able to see that they are both equal. These two sides are equal. 
this minus this is 4 um, sorry it is 8 rather and then 2 times 4 will give 8 so this is to also confirm that the second value of x which is 3 is also satisfying thank you for watching and if you love the way i solved this video um this math problem look at it over here if you love the way i solved it then give me a thumb up and um, share this to your friends